Hmm. Dark alley, oh god. Now. <gasps> what did I tell Careful, you? Careful, Chuan. She's a screamer. Raven will be pleased that we bagged us a spy. Oh my god, what did I tell you? Because you know what? He, uh... Asking about you. There's no question about it. She's a spy. She does not look a zaddy. Like that matters. You can't tell and you can't trust anyone. Let's get rid of her. Bryn? All I'm saying is, let's not take any chances. She might have a tracking spell on her for all we know. I would have detected it. There's something peculiar about her, but no magic. Peculiar? What did I tell you? She's a spy, all right? Come on, let's get rid of her. Quiet. I'll speak with her. Alone. What? Why? Bryn, don't make me lose my patience with you. You need to trust me. But I... Bryn? Come. Now. Fine. Fine. But don't say I didn't warn you. So, why are you asking questions about me? Where am I? Who are you? I'm asking the questions here. Wait, you're April, aren't you? I recognize you from the picture. What? What picture? A picture of you and your friends. Charlie and Emma. I was in your old room at the Victor... In the border house in Newport. Charlie told me about you. That you disappeared and that... Whoa, slow down, slow down. You know Charlie and Emma? How's that even... How are they doing? I only just met them. At the Fringe. Back in... Uh, back in my world. Stark. I'm guessing you're not a spy. I don't even know how I got here. Last thing I remember... I was at the fringe. I was going upstairs to make a call, and then... Black. When I woke up, I was in this strange place. A subterranean city. And there were these... Oh, these creatures. I had to fight them. And all the time I was saying to myself, It's just a dream, Zoe. Just a dream. Except... Except it's no dream. I know the feeling. When I first came here, I refused to believe what my eyes and ears were telling me. But you learned to accept the truth. You have to. You're a shifter. You've traveled through the divide between worlds. You're in Arcadia. A shifter? That's what Ben Rime and Minstrom Magda told me. What's a shifter? It'll take too long to explain. You're special. How's that? You can travel between worlds. Travel. That is my alarm. So how do I get back to our world? Telling me I must Your end world, this not mine. soon. You just do it. Once you learn how, it's like blinking with your mind. But I can't even remember how I got here in the first place. First couple of times, it's hard. It's easier when you're asleep. I wasn't sleeping. At least, I don't think I was. It's fuzzy. I'm sure you'll figure it out. What's your name? Zoe. Look, Zoe, I'd let you go, but I don't want you walking around out there asking questions, drawing attention to yourself. We'll have to put you somewhere... safe. Until you can find your way back to Stark. No. No, I'm here now, and I need your help. What? Why? Something's happening back in the real world. In my world. And I think you're connected to it somehow. I've been... Receiving this strange message, like a, I don't know, a vision broadcast through the wire. I keep seeing a snowy landscape with a scary black house that looks like a doll's house. And a little girl. Find April Ryan, she says. Save her. Over and over again. Receiving? How? Through dreams? No. No, on screens. It's like... like some kind of static interference. What does it mean? Don't ask me. I don't need saving. You've got the wrong woman. I don't think so. This girl. She led me to your room where I found the picture. It can't be a coincidence. It can't? You're sure about that? Look, Stark's not my world anymore. You've got problems, you figure them out. That's what I had to do. I'm done with the saving of the world. Ask someone else. But 
I'll help you get back. It's either that, or we lock you up somewhere until you figure out how to use your powers. And what do I tell your friends? Tell them whatever you want. The April Ryan they knew is dead. I'm not part of their world anymore. So you're not going to help me? You're not curious to find out why I keep getting these messages about you? What if something big is going down and... Like I said, not my problem. I've played my part. Just leave me alone. Now, do you want to go back or not? I do. Of course I do. Yeah, let's wrap up this Good. dialogue. Zoe... Like I said, if this doesn't work, we'll have to make other arrangements. Okay. We're going yeah. to put you under hypnosis and unlock the part of your subconscious that controls your shifting powers. Lie down on that bed, and I'll be right back. Okay, please get control. What of my are you going to do? Again. There's a part of you that knows how to travel. I will help you remember what you have not yet learned. And I'll end up back in Newport. Can't guarantee you that. You might end up somewhere else. Just try and focus on a familiar place. A safe place. So you're not going to help me? You don't need my help. Lie still. What's she talking about? Something's going on back in our world. A good friend of mine's disappeared, and... And you need to not talk. Or would you rather have me lock you up? And I think April can help me find out what's happened to him, and why. So why won't you? Because I have enough trouble in my life already. Because I'm fighting a war, and because I'm done with your world. Now this is your final chance. Close your eyes. Breathe slowly. Don't speak. Listen to Na'ane's voice. Na'a. Amam. Ayan An. Listen to my voice. Let it carry you into yourself, into the secret places in your mind. Ane An. Ayan An. A Ayan An. I don't feel a thing. What's this supposed to. <laughs> what just happened? I do not know, April An. She did not open a shift, and her clothes. They're still here. Where did she go? I do not know. I have never seen anything like it. It is almost as though she was smoke blown away by a wind. Is she dead? I cannot say. I do not feel her here, in this world. But I will say this. I do not think this girl is a shifter. Then what is she? And where did she go? Okay. So, um... Interesting. Well, this looks completely different. I'm in control of a man? I'm, oh, I'm in control of a man! Uh, oh, okay. You boys might make warriors someday. Okay, this is, uh, in interesting. I don't know what to make of this. Oh my, oh! 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 Come on. Oh, this guy's a much better fighter. Come on. Fine. I'll attack then. Okay. Another one? Round, uh, round three? What is, um... Yeah, Zoe couldn't fight for crap. Are you not gonna fight me? Fight me. Fight me. 
Fight me! He's not even fighting back. Yeah, that's right. Come get some. Really? He's just gonna. What do you want? A pat on your rum? You did well, but you can do even better. I can do even better. Grah! I am a very muscly, masculine looking dude. I can. That's it? No more challengers? Alright, guys. Well, I'm gonna have to end this here. We will pick this up later. It's extremely late. I couldn't sleep. Thought I'd treat you guys to another video. And hope you've been enjoying it so far. And I will see you next time. And we'll figure out just why we are around uh, all these big, tough, warrior, manly looking men. And so, have a good night. And uh, happy, happy holidays, guys. <laughs>